been to food. It was at this moment Jackson knew he fucked up. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Take two. Morning, everybody. It is the day of cars and coffee in Brescia. I'm in the hotel room, and I've just noticed if we go down here, I think we're the only remaining car in the car park. You know what? Let's go down. Whoa, okay, well welcome downstairs where this car used to be surrounded by a bunch of other supercars. They've all left now. I've been struggling to upload a video, so it's been a bit of a morning struggle, but look, there's literally no one left. I feel like we're the last people, because we literally are, to be going to this event. So I'm gonna hop into the car now. Virginia's already all packed in, ready to go. And we're going to go to this Cars and Coffee event, which is about 30 minutes away, I think. And then we are going to stay there. I think I might clean the car before there's a petrol station nearby. And also I don't have the address of where we're going, so yeah. Welcome, welcome, we've arrived, we've made it to Cars and Coffee and it, this is one of those events, you know when you show up there's too much to take in so I don't know where to start. This is where we're parked up, definitely got one of the dirtiest cars of the show but I think that makes it look kind of cool. And then we're in the Lotus area where we've got, what do we have? So I'll walk you through a few cars, I'll talk to you about some of the cars and then the rest we'll do time lapse music stuff. We've got Exige 350, oh a matte black club racer, Swiss plates as well, that's really nice. And then a bunch of Avoras, oh we've got Rana cruising in up there. This is one special looking Avora 400 in the golf colors. It's really, really nice. Then we got the Audi section with a bunch of R8s. One funky looking one with a yellow on the side of it. And then all of the Alfa Romeos. It's pretty, pretty cool. Right, anyway, let's explore further. We're now entering hypercar land. So first things first, we got a 918. This one's got the Visec pack and this one does not, but it's got the liquid silver color. So it looks really, really nice. And then Crow GT. This one's the one I filmed with in Monaco. I don't know if you guys remember. And then one with a black interior which is really nice, and another one with the beige interior. These things are absolutely stunning. Ferrari land now, so we got all of the Ferrari hypercars. What we got? Two F40, a LaFerrari, and an Enzo. If I had to talk to you about every car here, it would just take so long, so I think it's probably more wise if I just cue some music, show you all the cars, and then later on, I'll recap and tell you my five favorite cars from the whole Cars and Coffee. Let's kick off my five favorite cars that I hear at Cars and Coffee. My first number one favorite car is the Zonda. Look at this beast. Zonda F, not Roadster. I prefer them in Roadsters, but this is my favorite car ever built. And it looks absolutely stunning. Pagani are always here at Cars and Coffee Brescia. And then conveniently, my second favorite car is right next to it, Huario Roadster. The brand new one, the one I saw in Geneva, actually. If I spin the camera around. I saw that car in Geneva, and it is so, so sexy. But for me, the Zonda, with the noise, the naturally aspirated, V12, it's just unbeatable. So these are my first two favorite cars and we're gonna need to go to a completely other end to show you the rest of my favorite cars at the show. YouTuber crew, YouTuber how are we crew doing? Indeed. We're good. YouTuber crew in the oh, shade we're, under we're a tree. We're enjoying the one bit <laughs> exactly. of, sort of yeah. calm and tranquility in the shade. Yeah. Exactly. That's the mine cars. Oh, yeah. That's yeah, yeah. what car, Cars and Coffee is all about, really. If you just had to sitting. say your one favorite car here, right now. Me? In five seconds. I heard, I heard there's a really nice purple one just up there. Yeah, I heard it's a 675 LT, oh, right? Oh, there's a red and gold. Yeah, I'm Lotus sure Exige, sure that thing, whoever spec that out. Yeah. yeah. yeah he did well. Nailed it. <laughs> Sorry guys. Enzo, Ferrari. Enzo, yeah, 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 yeah good chat. No, for me it would be this. The Carrera GT lineup's quite nice. Yeah, Carrera GT lineup's quite baller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going Three around, I'm showing them my five favorite cars. So far we've kicked it off with Zonda number one, Quarrier number two, and then Papa I'm gonna LT go see my... Three. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to the next one. I'm making the conscious decision of making this. No, no, not number three, actually. It's very, very, very cool, but not my number three favorite car. Very sexy, though. Tim has nailed it with that car. Ooh, 570S. Now, this is my third favorite car from the show. 599 GTO, and this particular one in matte gray looks absolutely unbelievable. Over 600, I think it's 670 horsepower, naturally aspirated V12. These things have gone up in value, shot up over the last few years, and it looks just so beautiful and deft 
definitely my number three. And then we're gonna kick number four off right over here with a TDF. So the successor to the 599 GTO, which is beautiful. I personally wouldn't get it in red, but it's my third favorite car for sure. Sorry for the shakiness, guys. It's hard to hold this camera steady, but this car is stunning. And my fourth favorite car from the show for sure. And now let's kick it off with number five, which is another Ferrari. Have a quick stop in the Porsche section where there are, <laughs> look at this lineup of Porsches. GT3s, GT3 RSs, turbos, everything is here. And they look really, really nice. It's a bit of a gray area though. One exciting color, but apart from that, everything else is fairly bland. But round up here, let's click. This is my fifth favorite car from the show, the LaFerrari, which looks absolutely stunning. This is the spec you see a lot of them in, but it just looks so cool. Every time I see one of these, if I go around this sign, every time I see one, it just shocks me at how cool it is. Look how low the front end is, and it just looks like an absolute beast. And on that jolly note, I am absolutely starving. There are so many cars that I literally just could not share. I mean, just now walking around, beautifully specced. 911R with gold stripes. We got a baby blue 650S Spider. Tech Art Porsche up that way. There are just too many cool cars. I wouldn't be able to show you every single thing. But right now I'm gonna go grab some food, have some lunch, and then after we're driving to the public side of the event, which should be pretty mental. Bum 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 <laughs> Look who I found is Donze. How you doing? Good, good. You enjoying the day? Yeah. Oh, and we got Lucrezia. <laughs> How's everything? Fantastic, fantastic. It's you had summer. a good day? It's summer. I know, it's amazing, right? It's amazing. And you're driving back to Monaco tonight, aren't you? Yeah. You yeah. Too? No. No? I'm going... I don't know where we're going, but we'll figure it out. Yeah, somewhere in Italy. I think we're staying in the same hotel tonight and then going somewhere else. Tomorrow, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now we need food, so yeah. let's uh, spin to food. It was at this moment Jackson knew. He fucked up. Boom. <laughs> Well, what a scrumptious lunch that was. As you can hear around me, all the cars are starting to leave. As the R8 leaving. We appear to be one of the last cars as well because I was filming everything and doing some editing, but we're now going to hit the road. There's a massive traffic jam up that way, which you can't yet see with all the cars parked up, but it's about a 30 minute drive to the next location. So let's cue the music and get driving. We're going to follow the tech arts, I believe, with Mark at the wheel because I'm not too sure where we're going. But I mean, look at the surroundings right now. Carrera GT, we got some black and gold beautiful cars right there actually they look quite cool in convoy we got lotus savora in front and overall just a cool little uh, setup so let's cruise over to the next location we're here we have arrived so oh, a bunch of really really cool cars this is an awesome event Look at this, all the cars are parking up and there are just people all over. It really felt like we were back on Gumball, amazing spirits and the roads around here. Shame we had a bit of traffic, but apart from that it was all good. I've shown you my five favorite cars. We just got a bunch of Bicolore uh, Gallardo, F430s, Aston Martins, Ferraris, everything all over the place. And Virginia Instagram storying me. <laughs> There appears to now be a traffic jam in front of us to get out. I was planning on catching up with you guys uh, at the hotel because we're driving past. We've just stopped to get a, a little bit of a snack and I'd forgotten my toiletry, so I got a toothbrush and things like that. And when we stopped here, we've got some of the cars and coffee cars which have just shown up. So look at this flipping F40 for GD3 and we've just shown up. This thing is stunning. So, yes, not much else I can show you because we need to rush off. Just thought I'd, uh, I'd show it to you guys. This is pretty mental. Anyway, we're going on a bit of an adventure. Oh, I can't even speak properly. We've seen a bunch of stairs that lead up to a nice view and the sun's going down so we want to go see it. But I think it's going to be a long walk. I'm not ready for this. Oh my god. This is gonna be a mission. <laughs> this is gonna take a while, guys. <sighs> <sighs> okay, well, we're nearly there. Oh my god. We made it. We made it. Oh my god. What a view. That is pretty spectacular. I'm exhausted. It's been a pretty spectacular day. Thank you to everyone who came to say hello. 
at the Cars and Coffee Brescia event. I'm going to end the video here. We're not sure what we're doing tomorrow, either staying in Italy or driving back to Monaco or going to Saint Tropez. We have no idea, but catch up with you tomorrow for another vlog. Thanks for watching as per usual. I'll see you soon. Uh, bye bye. Hey, yo. Quick cap saying, Saturday in the mouth. Snow Juliet.